Hi beauties! So today's look is inspired by a Via Trotter, which is another one of the hybrids from Monster High's movie, Freaky Fusion. Okay, so the lid is inspired by her hair and skin color, so blue and purple. And the feather type of the sign above the crease is the type of eye makeup that she's wearing. And I didn't draw a lot of feathers along my lower lash line like she has because I have a few wrinkles there and it just wouldn't look cute. But I did add a few pink lashes there instead. I hope you enjoy the tutorial and let's get started. I've already applied the Urban Decay Primer Potion and now I'm going to use this purple eye crayon by Berry M in number 10. I'm placing it at the inner part of the lid and I'm also using it to cut my crease. Here I'm blending it out with a concealer brush to prevent creasing. At the outer half of the lid, I'm going to apply this NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Electric Blue. I'm first using it to wing out the outer corner and then I'm bringing it back in towards the purple. And then I'm filling in the rest of the lid. On top of the purple base, I'll be placing this loose shadow by Sugar Pill called Hysteric. Then on top of the blue, I'll be placing another Sugar Pill shadow and this one's called Starling. I'm drawing the shape of the feathers using the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. And here I'm filling them in. Next, I'm going to use Sugar Pill Shadow in Love Plus, and with this, I'm kind of drawing some downward going arrows. Then I'm filling them in to this type of shape, which is really hard to explain. I'm drawing another feather at the outer corner, a little bit higher up than the crease. Here I messed up, so I went in with a clean liner brush to clean that up. I'm drawing one underneath my eye as well. Now I'm filling in those two with red. Next, I'm going to go in with this light pink by Inglot in number 359. And I'm creating the same type of shapes like I did with the red. Mm -hmm. 
Now I'll be using this green shadow by Makeup Forever in number 91 and I'm using it to fill in the rest of the feathery design. I'm also applying it along my lower lash line. Here I'm using the L'Oreal Super Liner in Carbon Gloss to line my eyes. Now I'm making a tiny wing at the inner corner. The final step to the feathery design is to outline with the same L'Oreal liner and for that I'm using a tiny nail art brush. Okay, so here I messed up again and this time with the liquid liner. And to fix this, I waited about a minute for the liner to dry and then I went in with a toothpick and just pushed that liner into place. To fill in my waterline, I'll be using Inglot's Black Gel Liner in number 77. And to set that in place, I'm using Sugar Pills Black Shadow called Bulletproof. Now I'm applying the Rocket Mascara by Maybelline. At the outer part of the lower lash line, I'm going to place three of these pink lashes. They are by Sugar Pill and they're called Whisper. I'm placing them underneath my natural lashes. For false lashes, I'll be using these ones called Bohemian Princess by House of Lashes. Here's the completed eye makeup. Okay guys, so now I'm going to contour with my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. For blush, I'll be using this light pink one by Makeup Geek called Spellbound. Mm -hmm. 
To highlight, I'll be using the Cindy Luminizer by The Bomb. On my lips, I'll be using this purple lipstick by Inglot in number 95. As always, I hope that you like the look and check down below for a link to my Monster High playlist and I've also listed all the products that I've used. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you have a great day and I'll see you soon, bye bye!